Hey, what's up everybody? Glad you could join me. Stay tuned in this episode. We got some really weird stuff. So, let's get to it. So, uh, scrolling through eBay a few days ago, and uh, about a week ago or so, and it ran across a couple auctions that I just had to have, man. I couldn't pass up. Um, I collect a lot of stuff, primarily baseball cards, a few coins, stuff like that. But I recently, within the last couple of years, started collecting LPs, albums, for you young folks. That's not cassettes or CDs. It's the actual vinyl. And I was able to find a... Uh, one lot and one separate album that kind of fit in with my collection and stuff I collect. So it kind of killed, killed two birds with one. Hear that? Killed two birds with one stone. And uh, <clears throat> you can see here, this is part, part of one of the set. So one of the lots that I got there. It's the 1970 Sports Highlights, narrated by Kurt Gowdy. Well, that, there it is again. Narrated by Kurt Gowdy. Well, oh, that would be pretty cool. Of course, it's unopened. Uh, pretty neat. 1970 Sports Highlights. We got this one here. This one is unopened as well. This is the last story of Babe Ruth. It says the life story of Babe Ruth, greatest hero, relive all the exciting play-by-play -play action. And this is also a narr narrated by Kurt Gowdy. I think Kurt Gowdy was he the wild world of sports back in the day in the 70s. Um, we got this, this album here. This ought to be pretty cool. Um, this is the sounds of a half century at Yankee Stadium. If you can see all that or not. Glare on it. And, uh, you know, not only does this cover the baseball, but also... Football events, boxing events, and just about a little bit of everything that happened there at the stadium. And this, everybody knows this guy, was narrated by Mel Allen. So I'm really tempted to open this one up and listen to it just because of that. I love I love Mel Allen. We got some of you Pittsburgh fans, John Mangini. Do you have this? The World Championship 71 champion Pittsburgh Pirates narrated by Bob Prince. Pretty cool. See a picture of the team there on the back. Beat around the edge. The official record album and play-by-play -play action highlights of their 71 championship season. Narrated by Bob Prince. I had to break this one out just to see what it's all about. And then we get into my Reds. There's the um, Big Red Machine right there. You can see there's a picture of the machine. I always wonder what it looked like on the move. You can see there, everybody is loaded up in it. The drive to the National League pennant, is this from 75 or 76? Oh, this is 1970. I 
it's unopened as well. And then got a 75, and this one belongs to the Reds. Narrated by Marty Brenneman, all time great Reds announcer. You can see it's got the team photo on the back, a little history, and talks about them and the players. That was pretty cool. Sparky there. That's the from the 75 World Series. See my man Bench Rose there. But narrated by Marty Brenneman. Well, that was pretty cool. It's also un unopened. Think about opening that. Where is it here? Weird. You can check that out. And then my prize possession. Uh, all that was one lot, and then this was a separate purchase. One stop along the way, the Ballad of Johnny Bench. It's pretty cool. It's an actual song written about Johnny Bench. And <clears throat> also, it's the Cincinnati Reds version of Talking Baseball which is pretty cool. And then it's got some uh, Johnny Bench broadcast highlights from his career. So I'll let you listen to one stop along the way and throw up some pictures of, of Bench while we... First, let me check this out. I'll be right back. Oh, what the world is going on? What in the heck? What are you doing down there? Yo. Hey. What in the world are you doing? Oh. I get it. Spring training. Uh. It's it's been probably a boy's dream. Uh, nobody could expect more. As a youngster from Oklahoma, I think I dreamed of being Babe Ruth and uh, Yogi Berra and Mickey Mantle all rolled into one. Uh, I just expected things to fall into place. Uh, they went very smoothly and they went very easily, maybe far too easily uh, in a lot of respects to know how difficult it was. But I was given a great opportunity by the Cincinnati Reds to play baseball for their ball club and, and for this great city. It's been uh, just about everything uh, that uh, anyone can imagine.
Come now, goodbye.